Hello and welcome. No. Hello and welcome back. No. Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we are going to be embarking on a brand new journey. Today we are starting Dairy Girls. Now, if you've never heard of Dairy Girls or you don't know what Dairy Girls is, Dairy Girls is a UK sitcom TV show that follows five teenagers living in the mid 90s in a little town in Northern Ireland called London Dairy. If you didn't know that by the title, keep up. <laughs> keep up. So this show being set in the 90s, it means that we're slap bang in the middle of the Northern Ireland conflict. And if you don't know what the Northern Ireland conflict is, I'm going to give you a quick, very fast, very brief history on it, okay? Because uh, I get confused. Basically, this conflict was between Catholics and Protestants, as Protestants wanted Northern Ireland to remain in the United Kingdom. Whereas the Catholics, they wanted Ireland to leave the United Kingdom and to join a united Ireland. It's basically the same religion squabbling over the little intricate details of it, of the Pope of Henry VIII or the VI, I don't know. It's very confusing, but we're slap bang in the middle of this. That's basically a quick history lesson. I didn't explain it very well, so if you do want to read up on it, check Wikipedia. It's rather confusing. If you want to watch the full unedited reaction, you can watch it on my Patreon, link down below. But with that being said, let's just jump straight into Dairy Girls and see what we think. We're just going to binge it. Let's binge it. My name is Erin Quinn. Erin. I'm 16 years old and I come from a place called Derry. Derry. Sometimes all I really want is to be simply left alone. Is that my diary? <laughs> is it my diary? I just want to take this moment to apologise and say sorry to the country of Ireland for these feeble, disgusting and downright embarrassing attempts at an Irish accent. There's plenty more disgusting attempts to come. But I just want to apologise beforehand. It's embarrassing. What next? We'll catch a trying on my neckers. Don't say neckers in front of your father. He can't cope. Put <laughs> your what's a pair of neckers between cousins. Last of the neckers. Between <laughs> cousins. Mama, you're a burly. So are you. You should be having a lie in love. You're on your holidays. First day of term, Sarah. Is it I? It is I. <laughs> is it I? What is wrong with you? But you're not Stop it! But I'm not enjoying this bomb. I have an appointment in Tropicana at 12, 15 minutes in the stand up, but sure, I'll not get over the bridge at this rate. <laughs> That's um, stupid. That's I'm stupid. I'm pretty sure interfering with your sunbed sessions isn't very high up on anyone's political agenda, Aunt Sarah. I wouldn't be so sure. <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure. I should be allowed to express my individuality. I'm sorry, I'm not wearing my blazer. End of story. Pass me the wooden spoon. Oh, another wooden spoon! I've been hit with a wooden spoon. Ba, 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 ba. Well, I'm not being an individual on my own. I know her. She's in things. Like, everything I've seen about Terror Girls is always her. It's always this girl. Right, stick. What is it with you in Africa? Who are you sponsoring? How much? Two pounds. Father Conway showed us a video and there's this one wee fella, Sorry. Kamal. He's only ten and every morning he walks 25 miles to the nearest well. It's more like from here to Bally Buffet. Shut up. From here to Bally Buffet. Sure you'd be knackered? Kamal <laughs> is knackered. Kamal! <laughs> Stop slagging off Kamal. Kamal doesn't have it easy. <laughs> oh, no, you touch them, you buy them. Right. It's just I can't afford them anymore. Have to give all my money to Kamal. <laughs> what the fuck's Kamal? Do you want to sponsor me, Dennis? Oh my god! Get out! <laughs> Not this! Not this. Here, have you got a light? Me? No, I don't smoke. I have one. I don't smoke either. I just like mouth and stuff. <laughs> I don't smoke either. I just like mouth and stuff. That's stupid. Hi, I'm Michelle's cousin, James. Why is he making that funny noise? He's English, Ola. That's the way they talk. He's English. He's meant to Cathy's way. She went to England years ago to have an abortion, never came back. Never got the abortion either. Look at you, James, eh? <laughs> oh, my God. I didn't actually know that. <laughs> Everyone was shitting it about sending to the boys' school. They were worried the other lads would beat him up because, well, he's English. This is it. This is it. In Ireland, in Scotland, sorry to the English, but we're very much like... 
But if you're a Celtic nation, you know, the English have done a lot to us that um, it stays with us through generations. <laughs> you guys know I was just kidding, right? All right, shift to short holes, let's go. Nobody move. Oh. You better do as I say, or, or what? We'll beat you up. <gasps> Wonderful. <laughs> Wonderful. Grand, I'll meet you after school and you can beat me up. What's happening exactly? <laughs> Mr. Mandy. You might know her. Mandy O'Connell. Now fuck off. Right, we'll do. Oh my god. This just seems like it's gonna be a nice easy watch, to be honest. Like I feel like I'm just gonna be smiling cheek to cheek because it's funny. Fuck me, not the Africans again. Imagine being born there and not here. We don't know how lucky we are. I uh, fair to use Darius class. I does. Darius class. Do you think if I told him I had an incendiary device down my knickers, he'd have a look? <laughs> He's a soldier. If I had an incendiary down my knickers, that's funny. Great hair, very bold. I bold. Like that short. He's a fella, Jenny. Oh, I see. <laughs> Anywho. <laughs> Seriously, shoot me in the face. <laughs> James will be the first ever boy to study here at Our Lady Immaculate College. <laughs> God. He was due to start a Christian Brother Boys, but there were serious concerns for his safety because, well, unfortunately, James happens to be English. <laughs> it's an all gear school, duck face. There are no boys' toilets. So should I just use the girls' toilets? No, you should not, you fucking pervert. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, okay, no, it's not funny. It's really not funny. Please, I should <laughs> This is stupid. This is Fucking funny, why, why have I not watched this? I'm not going down for something I didn't do. If anyone deserves to get punished, it should be Michelle. <laughs> she folded very quick. Well, I think it's safe to say we all just lost a bit of respect for you. <laughs> um, since there's no male student toilets on the premises, am I permitted to use the staff ones? Absolutely not. Now, I think you're <laughs> We're very sorry, very Tina. Sorry, Tina. Sorry, sorry, Tina. Tina. Sorry. I don't accept it. <laughs> I like her. She's a bad bitch. I need to draw a line under this somehow. So. That's funny. Oh, straight to detention. I don't accept it. Go off, girl boss. Pussy hat slay. Not you being first day back after summer and getting detention. This is agony. Can you please stop crying in my face for five fucking minutes, James? <laughs> <laughs> oh, James. I do feel bad for him. Pull yourself together. That is funny. Give that here. Ox sister? No. <laughs> Ox sister. <laughs> Shouldn't you put that in the confiscated box? Quiet. <laughs> she went a new Mac Lippy. That would be nice. That colour's been discontinued. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, guys, why is it one joke after another? I'm not getting a moment to like actual breathe. This is like joke, 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 joke. Oh, look. Your boring fucking diary sent you to sleep. Is she asleep or is she dead? She looks fucking deep. Jesus, that's disgusting. Stop <laughs> it. That's English for you fucking savages. <laughs> fucking savages. She sleeps with her eyes wide open. What? Oh, she's dead. Sweet suffering, Jehovah. No. <laughs> oh my God, not the pit. Oh no, did she die? Did she actually die? She died. <laughs> Oh, bitch, here we go. What in God's name? Did you kill that wee nun, girls? <laughs> Why were you pissing on her dead body? And like <laughs> Did you kill that wee nun, girls? Then why were you pissing on her dead body? Uh... Say nothing till we've seen a lawyer. <laughs> Say nothing, girls. Say nothing till we've seen a lawyer. Oh, killing nuns now, is it? <laughs> Do you wait until your mother hears about this? Please. Does anybody else have any thoughts on the whole her being almost 98 years of age thing? Struck down in her prime. <laughs> Struck down in her prime. <laughs> the woman was almost 98 years of age. She had a heart attack. Why is everybody going absolutely mental? Less of the cheek, Erin. But the thing is, life isn't fair. You see, injustice is something I have become a Is she reading from that f***ing diary again? Violence is never the answer. <laughs> I am going to ram that so far up your heart! 
sorry, sorry. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That was so fucking funny. This is funny. I thought it was gonna be funny, but I didn't realize it was gonna be funny. <laughs> Come on and let it show. Did I not ban this one? Uh, no, sister? She's banning it now. <laughs> Put on the list. <laughs> okay, that's one portion of redfish, one portion of whitefish, two bags of chips. No, no, no. Four. Four should cover it. Three, then. We'll compromise. I'll compromise you through that window. That's enough, dear. The tight bastard's trying to starve us all, Mary. <laughs> okay. I get, I, I'm getting the dad and the, the granddad are not getting along, and it's very funny. I love a chicken fillet burger. No lettuce, no tomato, no cheese. I just write plain, will I? No onions, no cucumber. One plain. No relish, no pickles, <laughs> no mayonnaise. No chicken. What do you mean, no chicken? <laughs> this is so funny. It's a chicken burger. Of course I want chicken. <laughs> What are you? A simpleton? Hello. No chicken. <laughs> a simpleton. It's very typical of um, UK families. Like, this is literally UK families growing up, especially in Scotland and Ireland. Like, it just it is the... This is the vibe. It's so ridiculous. Our column's in the police station. Last night, two gunmen forced their way into his house, tied him up, stole his van. You ought to come straight round here, do you hear me? He is traumatised, Jerry. <laughs> You'll take a steak and kidney pie. <laughs> He'll take. He's traumatized. You'll take a steak and kidney pie. Bitch, they're all killing it. Every single one of these actors, they're killing it. Like they are just so in on it, and it's quick. It's so fast. It's like Jesus. It's so amazing, and I would play it again and again and again and again. And then he says to me, the slightly taller fella does. He says, "Step aside. We are armed." Class. Um, Alright, come on, let's pick it up. They tied you to the heater. They did indeed. They tied uh, you to the heater. By Jesus, they were absolutely desperate to borrow the own van. Call them they didn't borrow your van. They stole it. They stole your van, <laughs> used it to move arms across the border, and then they blew it up. You will never guess what she's done this time, Erin. Did she neck the notice board from the chip shop, Claire? <laughs> I was like a thief in the night. You were like a thief in the night? You actually were. <laughs> so from Vanilla of all people, I once saw her punch a Rottweiler, Michelle. <laughs> if she finds out about this, she'll kill you. you I once saw her punch a Rottweiler, Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> Firstly, we have the tutoring. And out of everyone, I thought you might be best suited to that, Claire, because... I'm the brightest. Well, in that conventional sort of way, I suppose. There's also... <laughs> There's also some gardening. This will require a bit of muscle, so you should take that one, Orla. <laughs> no, I should do that one. It's a man's job, Erin. I'm a man. That's debatable. <laughs> well, I'm more of a man than Orla. I do not accept that. <laughs> Come on, Erin. Fine. Save it, we fuckers! You save it, we fuckers! Where do we go from here? Your family. Well, you're good people. Well, you're decent people. <laughs> but I have to set an example. No. Dear God, no. Oh, no. I'm not talking about a ban. You can order pizza. Pizza is not as nice. No. You are right, Orla. Pizza is not as nice. Maybe you should have all thought about that. <laughs> is there nothing we can do? This is so funny. It's camp. It's camp of funerary. We're spending our Sunday scrubbing Finol's fucking fish hole for free. Aye, and she'll be back from yoga soon, so get a shift on. Would living without fried food really be so bad? Yes! I agree. I agree, it would be really bad. There is something fucking phenomenal about your local chippy. Oh, you just have a connection to your local chippy. You can't or You can't cook on a Friday, it's gonna be a chippy! Oh, sh**. Michelle just went upstairs. <laughs> Michelle! <laughs> Michelle is such a wild card. When I was growing up, I used to know girls like Michelle and this is like the perfect example of what they were like. They were just absolute psychopaths. Oh, you sit yourselves down and have a wee drink. No, Michelle, it's wrong. So are those ski pants, Claire, but that doesn't stop you pulling them over your hole this morning. <laughs> no. That's like a violation. That's very muggy. Slaunch a motherfucker. <laughs> 
No way. Ain't no way. Oh, James to the rescue. Oh my God. How are we going to explain this? How are we going to explain this? Wow. On a scale of one to 10, how dead do you think we are? 11, 15, 25. Oh God, you're banned. No chippy. No chippy. Are you expect me to believe that Michelle tripped while carrying a scent of candle? You must think I come up the foil in a bubble. <laughs> they threatened him with physical violence. <laughs> they threatened to burn his house down before my <gasps> No. <laughs> I can't watch this. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, my God. This is so stupid. This is so stupid, but it's so f***ing perfect. Do you think we should knock them about a bit? No. Not even the wee gay though. I'm not gay. <laughs> <laughs> not even the wee gay guy. Hi, gay. Happy Pride Month. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's locked. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck's going on here exactly? What happened was Michelle was carrying the scene. <laughs> It's just not as nice. Is it pizza? Is it pizza? <laughs> so what I'm getting from this is that every episode is going to be a different situation that they're just going to find themselves in. And I love, 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 love storytelling like that. Oh, I, I just feel like I'm laughing though. I don't feel like I'm giving any commentary. I'm just laughing. Like, it's just funny. I just can't get my head around it. The fact that he's gone. <gasps> Forever. He's in a better place now. Unless he's not, you know. Unless it's the dog. Is it the dog? Correct! I shouldn't even have to sit the exam. And you know, compassionate groans. He was a dog, Aaron! <laughs> it was the dog. Well, I can't tell my rebellions from my writings. And whose fault's that? If your lot had stopped in vagueness for five fucking minutes, there'd be a lot less to wait for. <laughs> Period. English prick. Oh. Anyone? No sausage. We omelet, maybe. Anything at all? It's absolutely no bother. I'll have a cup of tea, so Joe. Make your own tea. <laughs> you stay over too, son? Yes, I did. That's correct, sir. Look, look. I know the fella's gay. I'm not gay. But gay or not? <laughs> you said I was gay. He's still a fella. There's still a good chance that he's a rapist. I mean, no offence, son. <laughs> oh my God. Well, that's that done. God rest his wee soul. What happened to Toto? It's just hit me so hard. It might affect my performance. Oh, come here, love. <laughs> Look, if you fail the exam, I promise you, there'll be a nice wee plot out there with your name on it. <laughs> <laughs> Get her, Jay. Doesn't that dog look like Toto? I suppose it does a bit, yeah. Oh, my God. What are we doing? I don't know. I'm still pushed. Huh? I'm still pushed. <laughs> It's like Toto ran away and the mum sat there and said like, oh, the dogs died just because they couldn't find Toto. Oh, not in the church. <laughs> she smirked. Hey, big M. Hi. Big M. She just smirked. Big M. Are you sure you didn't just... Jesus. Me too. The holy smirk, thank you. <laughs> Three of us thought, Aaron, how do you explain that? The That's holy the smirk. One. <gasps> no. <laughs> Onto the statue. She's crying real oh tears. My oh my god, the dog piss. The dog piss running down the, the Mary statue. Come in, father. <laughs> god. Not this. Not this. Father. Please. Obey. Call me Peter. Christ. <laughs> They're horn tea for Peter. Peter walks in and they got the girls gagging. Got me it's gagging. Your, no, it's your neck. It got does. me fucking gagging. You claim it started weeping. You're using the word claim a lot there, Peter. Girls, I'm not here to make any judgments. But sometimes we want to believe in something so much that we willingly deceive ourselves. I mean, That's I true. I don't like to use that word, sister, but it's so hard to describe James any other way because he's just such a dick. <laughs> what if this dog you saw, Aaron? What if it didn't simply look like your dog? What if it actually was your dog? Toto was sent back to lead you to that chapel, to that statue, because you're special, Aaron. 
my god, Erin's gonna fuck. She's gonna have fanny flutters. If you are lying, Erin, so help me, Jesus. I'm not lying. Swear on Dolly. <laughs> we must look in the burial place. What's he saying? I think he's saying he wants to dig up the wee dead. Oh my god, no. <laughs> Hurry the fuck up! Fucking weirdo. Fucking weirdo. This is crazy. What did I say? You look like a fucking ball bag. Your hair is all funny. I just put a bit too much mousse in it. That's all. Listen. Oh, James. James. Not James looking like the priest. The tears on the statue. Well, I actually have good reason to believe they were actually dog piss. No, you're not serious. That sort of makes sense. I'm not even sure I saw her smirk anymore. I definitely didn't see her smirk. I was lying, so. <laughs> I was lying. I mean, we're stealing a body. I should get it over with and never ever speak of it again. Jesus Christ, my nails are fucking ruined. <laughs> it's right. going to be empty, isn't Me it? Me and Michelle go stash him somewhere and the rest of you will fall it back in. <laughs> oh, no, actually, I can't. The mum lost Toto, didn't she? The mum lost Toto. Well, sort of, kind of. You're right, father. He has risen. <laughs> it's truly a miracle. Oh, bitch. So what happens now, Peter? Do you hear me, Malarkey? Why are you calling Maureen Malarkey? Granda says we're not allowed to speak to her. Well, that, that's all blown over now. Maureen Malarkey! Don't you mention that low-down deceit and cheap malign witch. <laughs> Message from Maureen Hang up, Erin. Toto, then we'll get back to you as soon as we can. She gave it to Maureen? He gave Toto to Maureen Malarkey? We take her had just passed. Oh, it's all adding up now. Oh my god. This is a gag. I'm gagged. I had lost him. Well, you have lost him. We're not taking him back. <laughs> Her mum's such a cow. I love it. No, that's, I actually thought James was Peter for a second there. That's so funny. What a day. <laughs> Oh, this is really hard. Oh, it's been incredible. I've been having a bit of a crisis of faith recently. Is that so? It became more challenging when I met this amazing girl. It's not going to be her. And who knows, if God hadn't sent me this sign, oh, I might have even left the priesthood to be with her. What if he didn't? It's not true. What? We're lying. We've been lying. None of it's true, Peter. It's all false. You're free. We're free. We can be together. Oh, God! Oh, my God. Oh, God. She's just, like, ruined his life, his faith, everything's gone. Oh, well, at least he can be with this girl. Not her, but this new girl. Where are you going? Peter, wait. I've decided to serve God. Don't be such a dick, James. Oh! <laughs> That's a wee shame. And Peter stood up for James. And James looked up to Peter. That's a shame. I have locked my mother in a cage designed by her own hand. Oh, she has been well and truly hoist by her own petard. Could you put it another way? I didn't understand a word. <laughs> <laughs> History exam. Oh, they got to do their exam. <laughs> this show is actually insanely funny. It's like actually hilarious. There's so much going on. It's just constant joke after joke after joke being put in crazy situations. It's so British. So Irish, so Celtic is so funny. I just love it. I'm having a great time. I'm having a great time and I'm so excited to just keep watching. We've only got three episodes left. Three episodes left. I'm fucking buzzing. I don't feel like I'm giving a comment a commentary though. I just feel like I'm just laughing. It's just funny. Oh, it's great. It's great. Part two of this video is coming to you very, very soon. So please let me know if you liked this video. If you did, leave a comment, subscribe, all that jazz. But yes, part two is coming very, very soon. Catch you in the next one. Peace.